Hello America, this is Michael Duncan Foster. I am in Crystal City, uh, Missouri. And uh, it's a beautiful out here. It's about 85 degrees. The flowers are spawning uh, everywhere. Uh, I forget what those call, the white flowers call that you blow on and they just go everywhere, but they're just flying everywhere in the street right now. And I wanted to bring you this beautiful American flag right here. Beautiful American flag. And remind you that this is the land of the free. Okay, I am out here for three causes. First cause, if you believe in God, good things will happen to you. Okay, if you truly open your heart and believe in God, good things will happen to you. Second is there still is good, kind-hearted people here in America. I have made it all this far from Houston, Texas to Missouri without uh, begging, without asking. Everything has came to me through good-hearted people. Okay, they've opened their hearts, opened their houses, open their pockets, everything, and I ask for nothing. I've never asked for a thing, except for in the beginning there at the Brookshire Brothers. But other than that, I've asked for nothing. It's, it's came through the kind-heartedness of good people. There still is good people out here in America. It's not all doom and gloom like what you see on the television. And the third thing is virtual freedom. I believe that we should have a social network platform run by cloud technology that is ran by the people and owned by the people. It's a co-collaboration website that uh, that gives us the freedom without cor without uh, corporate funding, without angel investors, without private entities owning it. We own it. We run it. And and I and if not, then I believe we need to have a constitutional amendment that allows us the same privacies and the same rights that we have in the real world on the online world. I don't think people should be able to look in our emails. I don't think people should be able to look at our Facebooks. I think we should be able to take the information off of there that we want to take off of there at any time we want. I consider Facebook a part of our house, okay? That is that is a part of our life. That's our personal business. And that means that we should have the same freedoms and rights and choices that we have in the real world on the online world. So I'm writing for virtual freedom. V free. Okay, that's where that's why I'm going to Washington DC first to point that out, to bring to raise awareness to that cause, and then I'm going to New York. And it's all about combining the south with the north it's all about us coming together in unity okay and if we can come together in unity through this social network and have you know open heartedness no blues no reds no biased opinions no msn no fox news uh, slanted news this is a place where we are free to talk about the issues without being brainwashed by any outside entities and and, and come up with the with the best conclusion. Our government uh, are fighting. You know, one wants this, the other one wants that. But you know, they both have good points. But neither one of them will give in. They won't compromise. So the people have to come together, and we need to come together in a free environment where we can uh, vote these people out so that we can get people in there that can make the best decisions for us okay the government is supposed to protect and serve the american people it's not supposed it's not supposed to enslave the american people and it's taking our freedoms away okay i love the government i love the media it's none of their faults that we've gotten where we're at but it's time that we need to change the direction into a positive atmosphere and through and through the belief of god and through and through us uniting in peace and love and not having any colors or racial racial barriers all coming together for one cause i believe we can change america in a peaceful way okay so i'll bring you more of that in the future but that is the third thing i wanted to to make you aware of and uh and i wanted to get far enough away to where I wanted to show people that I am serious about this. You know, Houston to Oklahoma or to Arkansas, okay, that's about a state away or two states away. But now I'm in Missouri. Now I'm serious about the cause. I'll do the work. If you come with me, okay, and unite, we can bring awareness to this cause and we can change America, okay? Freedom for all virtual freedom for all. Love you. Love America. God bless you. God bless America. God bless God. Amen. Peace.